Fork Nessick. Fork yourself. Being an Egyptian moving to America, you constantly get accused of being gay. <laughs> By your own dad. Right? Because in the Middle East, we hide our gay people. They're not out in the wild having parades, just as butterflies and centaurs. That doesn't happen. So Middle Eastern parents get nervous. They think you can catch gay like the flu. <laughs> like if a gay guy sneezed on me, I'd be like, give me some cocks. Ah! It's not true. So my dad was always testing to see if I was doing something gay. Right? My place was like the place that people came over, we'd listen to music, everybody was welcome there. So I'm in my room with my friends, my dad walks by, he hears music, he's like, music's playing, something gay must be happening. <laughs> so he kicks open the door and he's like, Habibi, you are wearing tight red pants, what are you, a gay? I'm like, no dad, I'm eight years old, it's Halloween and I'm Spider-Man. <laughs> I can see where he's coming from, though. Of all the superheroes, Spider-Man's kind of the most gay. Right? It is onesie. He's like, hey, guys. But he talks to criminals, right? He's like, hey, guys. Stop being bad, I mean it, okay? Serious. Seriously, stop being bad or I'll cover you in silk. He fights crime with fashion. That's really gay. 